Today's video, why do celebrities pay huge settlements when they say that they are not guilty? Why do they pay off? Well, if somebody's demanding $100,000 from you to shut their mouth and not bring the post story public, then it would be a lot better to pay off that $100,000, get your day in court, then win back your $100,000 when you are proven not guilty. Because the court of public opinion will completely crucify somebody way before your day in court ever shows up. And then even then, you still have to fight the whole battle of court while the public opinion is just crucifying you. And even the sad thing is, nowadays when people do pay off the settlements, the stupid public opinion says, well, why did he pay the settlement? It was to stop people making bad things up about him. Think about that. That's your only option, man. As a man, that's your only option. Why crucify him on that too? Why crucify a man for the fact of paying a settlement? Doesn't make no sense. Because after you go to court and you win and you are victorious, you can claim all the money back that you lost in the settlement. Plus more. So do a little research first before you start calling people bad names because they took and paid a settlement. That's complete insanity and stupidity. And that's the court of public opinion, unfortunately. A bunch of stupidity and people with IQs under 80 making up shit. Think about that. Your average person has an IQ of around 80, 90. Okay, 80, 90. And those are the voices that are going out there making the voice of public opinion. The whole court of public opinion should be crucified if you ask me. This is War Drums Fire. See you all later.